everybody, I'm Steve from Technophobia. This is Meatball, and I'm here to talk to you today about our new single, Rattle in Your Chest. The backbone of the sonic sound of Technophobia would definitely be our Sequential Circuits Pro 1 that we use for most of the bass sounds. Um, for this song specifically, did a deep dive in terms of soundcraft. Uh, one thing about Pro One, if you're not a synth nerd like myself, um, there's no presets. It's all physically dialing in um, a patch for each song. So I did a lot of soundcraft on this, and I did a lot of modulation. Modulation was a big part of this song, and I feel like it's, it's did a lot of modulation on this record. I used the pulse to control another aspect of the synth. And in this case, I used the LFO, low frequency, frequency oscillator, to control the filter cutoff in a way where it would filter in and out like this. So it comes, as, as the, the pulse comes in and out, it, the filter opens and closes. And what that does really, like, in, this, in terms of, like, songwriting and um, when we recorded it, it really adds an element of drive to the song and if we listen to the main part of the song, you'll hear it. You can hear the, uh, the Pro One filter, filter in and out. And that really gives the song a lot more drive and a lot more power, um, in my opinion. When it comes to the Dreadbox Nix, uh, this was another big deep dive for me because, you know, once again, there's a lot of patching possibilities with this. And with this song, um, specifically, you know, I dug into the architecture a bit to come up with um, very almost like disintegrating sounds. Uh, <laughs> You can hear the modulation on that. Hey, thanks for watching, and keep a lookout. Our next single drops on October 23rd on all streaming platforms, and our record will be released on December 4th. See you soon.